Hi, everybody. My name is Eric. I am a believer in the Lord Jesus Christ. Well, today we're talking about prayer because prayer is perfect. And we all pray. You know, prayer is a simple activity. It's just getting God's attention. It's just getting God to pay attention to us. It's a one-on-one experience. Can't fake it. Can't work it up. When God doesn't show up on the other side of that prayer, well, might as well just be talking to a coffee cup. But I am kind of like joking. The real true fact is there are times where God doesn't feel It feels as if he leaves us, and then we just keep praying. And we keep praying harder, and we keep praying as hard as we can, and we keep praying until he shows up, because he will. He's faithful. And I don't know why we go through these seasons where we are, like, forgotten, or um, (laughs) I don't know what word you want to call it, but it is very uncomfortable. When we are tangled up, all kinds of activity inside, outside, future, present, it doesn't matter, past, it's all mixed up in a big old ball of knots, okay? And so what are you going to do? Where are you going to start to untangle this thing? You know, you can't, but there's one connection. There's a connection with God where we call upon him for his mercy, to come over our lives, over our thinking, over our concerns, our heart. Everything we are, we lay our lives before him. This is a holy spot, and it's a spot of consecration, a spot of dedication uh, to be revered. And um, we don't put this out in the public that we pray like this, where we really get on our knees and we really ask God, for help. That's what we do. Now, when we love somebody so much, our families, our friends, our communities, this world, sinners in in general, when we love somebody so much that we bring them before our Heavenly Father, before the throne of God, where Jesus is seated at the right hand, right there, listening to every prayer we pray. And we pray because we love people, and we want to see God's Spirit come and change lives, or improve lives, or bring health to lives, or bring life to lives, or bring love to lives, bring spark, rejuvenation. Um, It's a dying wretched, sad existence without Jesus Christ. And that's the truth. What are we going to do? Let it go that direction? We're just going to let it slide? No. We are the righteous. We are the called. We are the select few, the elect, the remnant. We do godly things. We use these vessels to redeem others. We are in the service of Jesus Christ. This is a heavenly calling, righteous and pure all the way. Our fuel is through prayer. God continually gives us himself through his spirit, guidance and vision and strength empathy and compassion and kindness and virtue of all sorts. Well, prayer is perfect. We're not going to change that. Let's say a prayer right now. Lord God Almighty, we praise you and we bless you. You become more beautiful to us each and every day. We love you. Amen. All right, everybody. We'll see you soon.